My name's Callum and this is a review for treestuff.com on the Rock Exotica Rock D carabiner. Similar sort of carabiner to the Petzl AMD. As you can see, it's a little bit more angular at the top and the bottom, so you tend to push whatever you've got in it down to that point. I tend to use this with my Rock Exotica Omni blocks. Um, sits quite nicely down the bottom. Um, top bit's good to then clip onto whatever else I need it to. Um, you've got the same style gaiters, all your other Rock Exotica carabiners are pulled down and twist to open, which some people like, some people don't like. I don't mind it to the DMM ones. I do find though that it's a more of a pull and twist than the DMM ones, which are a twist upwards. It's just the way that the grooves being milled into the gate. Um, I have no problems with actually gip gripping this twisty bit, whatever you want to call it, and I find they've actually put the different cutouts where I tend to hold it. Um, I'm actually almost able to just open it with my fingers, which that's good. Um, not so much with the DMM ones, a little bit less easy, but that doesn't matter. This is, I don't really have favourite carabiners, but this is one of the best ones I've used. I buy the more expensive brands, the DMM, the Rock Exotica, the Petzl. I just find them easier to work with. I get extra couple months out of them. So, save me a bit of money in the long term. And they're just so much nicer to be, have up in the tree, so it actually improves my work efficiency. So yeah, um, Rock Exotica, Rock Deep.